Here we are, we have a, uh, a 9 bot one, okay, it's a smaller wheel, uh, less power. I'm going to show you how the battery works, so if I switch this on, and the wheel is on balance. So what I'm going to do is, while it's on balance, if I pull the power, what will happen? The wheel fell straight away, you see that? So as soon as I unplug the power, the wheel cuts off due to no power. So let's put that back in. There you go. So now it's back on. So I unplug it again. Ready? One. So <coughs> straight away, the wheel has lost power. Now what I've got here is a, uh, a big capacitor. There's two cap. Okay, this is a super capacitor. And uh, now we've got to put this in. So I want to plug this into the wheel. And then plug the capac uh, the battery into the, uh, the splitter. So now we've got our super ca capacitor and the battery together. So let's turn this on. So now the wheel is in balance. Okay. So what happens if the battery uh, can't provide enough power? So if we pull this out. One, two, three. So three seconds. You see the wheel drops off. So let's put that back in. So what it's going to do is uh, recharge the battery again. Now let's turn that back on. There you are. So the wheel is back on. Now, um, the idea is, is if there's, if you're riding the wheel and the battery power drops or the cell is not enough power to sustain the wheel, uh, the capacitor is supposed to uh, give you that power, which is reserved in the uh, capacitor. So what that will do is, um, it stops the, uh, the battery dropping so for that second it gives time for the battery to uh, come back online so that's what it does obviously you will lose power on the wheel and you will notice it and you see the wheel start to beep when it lose power uh, when the battery drops uh, it's an extra safety really that's what it's supposed to do okay uh, so that's how it's supposed to work now if I do that again so the wheel is on We've got the super capacitor in. I'm gonna disconnect the battery again, okay? Uh, which is here, the battery. Let's see how many seconds, yeah? One, two, three. Three seconds. So that's how it works. So let's demonstration uh, demonstrate this again. So this time, we have the uh, battery again into the wheel and we got the uh, got plus mod okay so this is the uh, got plus mod the uh, unit it's a it's a medium size one it's a little bit bigger so i'll just give it a few seconds to charge it up so it should be charged now so let's switch on the wheel and see what happened now the wheel is balanced you can see there now what will happen if I unplug the battery? Let's see how many seconds this gives us. Let's do that. Ready? Steady? Go. One, two, three, three seconds. Okay, same thing, three seconds. So now it sucks the battery back up to charge the unit. Let's do that once more. Okay, so let's do that again. Ready, steady, go. One, two, three, three seconds. There you go, guys. So that's what it is. So it's basically, is a uh, sort of capacitor and uh, it has been around a long time now. Uh, I mean, this is my 9 bot and that's the uh, backup battery for my 9 bot. 
yeah so the i the <coughs> the working method is the same uh, it's a capacitor that uh, sort of like helps the battery a little bit when it drains too fast and it can't sustain the wheel and the idea of this capacitor is it sustains the wheel at that movement okay when the wheel when the battery starts to drop and this kicks in so it gives you extra safety really that's what it does